Hey y'all, I am back with my second layout for June's Collection and Obsession using the September 2022 hip kit. I will put a picture, or I should have put a picture of the kit at the beginning of the video. And this is the paper that I used. And this is a total scrap lift from... Petra, and I can't say her last name, but she's over on the Hip Kit Facebook group, and it's a, it's a scrap lift from her and her brilliant idea to take this piece of paper that we got. Now, I'm missing this little corner, but I kept these pieces so I could show you um, what the original, kind of what the original sheet looked like, and it was just this swirl pattern, so... I cut, cut it out, and just was left with the the two blues, the purple and the yellow, and I stitched, and I stitched, and I stitched, and I stitched, and it, yes, it did take a while. I just poked holes along the design and picked coordinating colors and stitched and it is on a piece of white cardstock so you don't see the stitching from the back side so I did not want to take away from all that stitching that I put into the layout so um, and I'm sure that was the original designers intent also because it did take quite a while to stitch so the only embellishments are here and I kind of followed the flow of the layout and this is a uh, granddaughter and I was gonna do a picture of my grandson but I ran across this where we went to the park and was going uh, to the outdoor park and one of those tunnel slides. And so this kind of reminded me of a slide. So then I backed my two photos on some floral background paper. And in the embellishment kit, there was not a lot of flowers. So this is all fussy cut from a floor floral piece of paper look at that see I didn't glue that heart down that is why I glue all my stuff down um, because it doesn't want to stay sometimes so anyway I uh, uh, cut, fussy cut out some flowers and stems and then added some of the little dots and some of the chipboard heart, I mean the chipboard stars, and then there were some little puffy hearts. So that pretty much makes up this embellishment cluster. And then I took a couple of the chipboard phrases. This is so exciting, and you're one of a kind, because this was just a big blue um, platform where you climbed up a ladder, and so that kind of covered that up and then my title I used the stickers the letter stickers that came with the kit and these I love this size of um, letters and I put good times question mark because in my journaling um, my husband and I and daughter-in-law took my granddaughter a few years back to an outdoor park. This was when they lived out of state and were visiting and Burger King had just built this big outdoor playground. So we took her over there and they had a couple of those tunnel slides and as you can see, she was having a blast. And it was so funny because the static, her hair was just sticking straight up from the static from going down the slide. And then there was a bigger slide so her mama didn't want to send her down that slide alone. So she sat with her. And later I found out that you shouldn't do this. So be forewarned. Do not go down a child with a slide and put them in between your legs. Because what happened is her leg got caught 
And we actually got a, my husband actually got a picture of it because it was as she was coming out of the slide. Her leg got caught and she hurt her foot. So we ended up going to the emergency room. So that's the title, Good Times Question Mark. And luckily, it was just kind of like a sprain. And uh, so she didn't even want to try to walk on it for a couple of days. So, of course, you know, we got to baby her even more. <laughs> so, so, but all is good. And um, as I was writing my journaling, I misspelled upset. Because I was said we were all so upset, and I put U P E T or U S E T. I forgot the P or the S, and I'm like, oh my gosh! And I was journaling right on my background paper. So I just took a little O M G um, chipboard piece and a little heart. And covered it up, and then I went back and added this gosh here. So um, that completes my layout. And I really love stitching, embroidering. So I don't mind stitching, but it does um, take a lot of time, especially with this much stitching. So that is my second layout, and we'll see you next time. Bye.